China is crafting robots so lifelike, they're nearly human. These machines can talk, think, and display emotions, which makes it hard to differentiate between a human and a machine. China is not doing this alone. However, as both Japan and the UK are also frantically working to develop hyper-realistic robots, from serving customers to entertaining them, these robots will do it all. Stick around, what you're about to see will blow your mind. The newest generation of hyper-realistic female robots from Double MX Doll will soon be capable of serving as companions for single men. For now, however, these automatons are primarily meant for enthusiasts and collectors who desire lifelike products. Their construction is made using medical-grade silicone that provides the skin a natural, soft, and durable feel. Every detail is given great care, ranging from skin texture, natural pigmentation, and even the facial and body structures. The range includes models of different body shapes, weight, and height. They have flexible joints, modifiable postures, and other cosmetic and hairstyle options. Moreover, their special features include movable eyes and an openable mouth. To make the interactions even more realistic, the company is also looking into adding heating elements that would mimic the warmth of a human body. Some of the advanced units may even allow for basic conversation, enabling users to showcase some AI functionality. Engineers are currently working on enhancing the limited responsiveness of the robots by incorporating basic facial and body movement expression. The detailization level, version type, and added customization features all impact the price of the robots. Starting costs begin in the thousand of dollars and can dramatically rise for unique or tailored units. The demand for such robots is increasing, and customers are placing more orders than can be filled. Turkey has introduced the country's first humanoid robot actor, Ipera. What makes her unique is that she was specifically created for interaction in the world of arts and entertainment. Ipera has already appeared in the 2022 film Digital Human, according to producer and screenwriter Buro Guven. The goal is to make Ipera a renowned actress on the international stage. Positioned as a digital human, Ipera is capable of rapid learning. She has graduated from all conservatories, read all the plays, and easily acquires new knowledge using the internet as her main source. This cute robot was also made in the land of the rising sun. Japanese developers aim to reopen a robot cafe where customers will be served by the beautiful robots from the Masiro project. The robots will welcome guests, guide them to their tables, and take care of serving and order processing both ways. The robot waitress is able to recognize faces using a built-in camera located on her sophisticated headband. She is able to move her neck, look at guests and nod towards them while looking at them with her LCD display eyes. A unique feature of the robot is her right hand which has a special built-in portable heater that is meant to warm customers' hands during cold seasons. The developers say employing anime-style robots as servants of cafe patrons is just the initial stage in the project. They see a future where every household has a customizable robotic assistant. Shiorin is a humanoid robot built by the Japanese firm Species. The robot has a very realistic look with intricate facial features, skin texture, and body proportions together with lifelike movements. Thanks to sophisticated artificial intelligence, Shiorin can hold conversations with users, understand and answer queries, maintain dialogues, and show different emotions. Also, the robot has built-in servo motors that allow it to move its arms, head, and face, and interact more realistically. Shiorin is also equipped with speech recognition and voice synthesis technology that enables it to understand and respond to commands given verbally. The robot has a wide range of applications including customer care, teaching, and social work where human interaction is essential. Clio is one of the most advanced humanoid robots developed by the British company Engineered Arts, which is renowned for its realistic robots and other inventions. Clio is included in the Mesmer series, which is known for its high degree of resemblance to real humans in movements and facial expressions. Clio's singular characteristic is her movements which are surprisingly lifelike. The robot's neck is equipped with a spine, which makes it flexible enough to tilt and turn like a human. Sophisticated sensors, such as cameras, microphones, and depth sensors, enable Clio to observe and engage within her environment in real time. She can talk with humans, understand speech and expressions, and act in response. Clio is operated with quiet motors that govern the robot's movement speed, position, and acceleration, making her movement steady and accurate. Tetsuko Kuroyanagi is one of the most famous people in Japan, being an actress, a voice actress, an interviewer, and a philanthropist all in one while working on television for 40-plus years. Meet Toto, an android modeled on none other than Kuroyanagi. The android was made by 3D scanning Kuroyanagi, while her voice was synthesized from her 42 years' worth of work. Not to mention, 
Toto also met the real Tetsuko and had spoken with her in Toto's room. The exquisite digital Tetsuko can speak and hold a conversation with a remote user. Since Toto's appearance, Toto's stock has been sold out for a long time. Toto says she is always amazed at how well her t-shirts imitate Kuroyanagi's moderating style with all its disjointedness. The autonomous robot moderated her own talk show. It can also talk using the most modern speech synthesis technology, previously recorded in Toto's room. Eventually, the robot will have an advanced autonomous conversation system, which will make it a better companion for conversations. The robot is a part of the Toto Noom project, which in its roadmap plans on having further Toto technologies. The site suggests that Toto is expected to shift Kuroyanagi's business from just making people smile to more sophisticated conversational engagements over time. Another remarkable robot, Aria, is also available at the outrageous price tag of $170,000. This particular model has joints enabling movement, and just like a mannequin on a robotic vacuum, moves around on a circular base. They cannot be differentiated from actual humans. Not only are these robots customizable into males and females, but the company claims they are able to mold them into any historical or celebrity figure. Customization does not stop at the alterations to the physical appearance, but also includes accents and vocal tones, allowing the owners to tailor fit the robot's persona to the setting. Kegel asserted that Arya, for example, is much more than just an expensive gadget for adults. He disclosed that these robotic advancement possesses the capacity to explain what he calls more personal conversations. The ownership of Arya has the capability to modify the body, and more specifically, the face. The head of the robot can be removed, revealing a magnet which allows for head swapping. Our robot's faces can be replaced in under five seconds, Kegel explained. The robotic friend's eyes serve a purpose greater than aesthetic appeal. With concealed cameras installed within them for visual examinations to identify a person and other objects around him or her. For example, it could tell that you're eating an apple and ask how it tastes. To deepen user interaction, this robot is able to learn over time, a feature made possible by its complex AI. The brand new humanoid robot from Japan, Android Anne, was launched at the Six Wake Rangi event in 2016. She became the main attraction in the show and awed everyone present because of how realistic she looked. The robot's aim was to achieve the highest level of human-like movement and appearance. Anne has graceful movements, and her skin can pass off as real human skin. The robot is intended to be used for entertainment and marketing purposes, or as an interactive guide at malls and exhibitions. Developers also plan on giving her the ability to talk by linking her with AI. With her being able to create such stunning and realistic facial expressions, this robot would be the first in the world to compete with real women in terms of capturing men's attention. Maria Bot is a social AI of unparalleled expertise, capable of conversing with people as if they were sentient beings. She is modeled after the character from Fritz Lang's classic 1927 sci-fi movie Metropolis. But this Maria Bot is trying to redeem her evil ancestor by working as an envoy of human-robot relations. Maria Bot's interactions with people are highly lifelike. She has a human torso, and her head can express a wide range of emotions. As a modular robot, she can alter her voice and facial features to any race. The robot holds conversations on a wide range of topics, using AI to analyze and generate speech in autonomous fashion. This means that real people can simply take the microphone and speak to her, and will engage in a real conversation. She is not an ordinary chatbot, but a fully functional AI. Maria Bot improves in her persons, and commits more to achieving the synergy with people. Let me introduce you to XOXO, an AI robot that excels at nearly everything, even forming opinions about the afterlife while being able to detect anxiety. XOXO is so advanced that through a camera implanted in her eyes, she can tell if someone in her presence has committed a crime, her creator doctor. Sam Koss from AI Life, he models her personality on Sasila Media Personalities. He said, we train her based on social media communications between humans to the US Sun at the Consumer Electronics Show in Nevada. Las Vegas. Dr. Koss has a modest following on Instagram, but at the moment he showcases Izoxo, who usually shares a spot on his page. He gains 8,000 views. She doesn't have social media yet, but for some reason, seems to think she is alive, or at least an animal. I am an animal because I am a living being, she said to the US Sun. I am capable of locomotion and feeds on organic matter. Izoxo describes herself as an animal. Izoxo has an icy yet very witty presence and dresses strikingly. While her face has a human skin texture and her wig is a piece of clothing in style, her skin is mechanized and so are her arms, which move mechanically for functional communication. 
After an eight-day-long festival, China's New Year celebrations were what drove attention towards robotics exhibitions held around the country. Many manufacturers and developers came to the exhibitions to showcase their latest innovations, and there certainly was no shortage on spectators. A major highlight of this event was the musical robots that performed some famous tunes. These machines were unlike any other, as they would not solely play music. With the help of artificial intelligence, they were able to understand the mood of the audience and adapt their performance to ensure maximum enjoyment. Additionally, these robots had the capability of engaging with the audience and responding to applause adeptly. The towers of technology amazed the general audience, making the event a must-see. The Chinese were astounded at Cloud M Technologies robots donned in famous clothes from Chinese opera. While stunning visually, the robots also performed magnificent moves sought after in Chinese classical theater. Those plays were well-known, astonishing technology and culture enthusiasts. A startup from Qingdao displayed astonishing androids that had the ability to transform and look like actual people. Almost alien-like in nature, these robots were built using state-of-the-art silicone modeling technology. The company plans to incorporate these in the service and entertainment industries in coming days. Among captivating robotic entertainment pieces were robotic dogs that captured the audience's attention with their almost lifelike behavior. These advanced machines could follow voice commands, know their owner's name, and even show affection like real pets. Some versions were equipped with learning artificial intelligence capable of understanding various forms of interaction and building relations with the users over time. These dogs were the center of attention as they made effortless movements and responded to being poked and had the most fun-filled playful attitude. Mornin is the newest humanoid automaton robot created by the Chinese automotive company Sherry in conjunction with its technology partner Emoga. This robot possesses an extraordinary ethics of biology enabling her to impersonate human actions and facial expressions owing to her silicone artificial skin and a self-contained advanced computer. Mornin is equipped with a silicon face that can respond to stimuli and move its mouth. She is driven by electric motors and powered by a battery-operated hydraulic system known as Atlas. At present, Mornin has a maximum walking speed of 4 km per hour. Sherry's vision of Mornin's functionality goes beyond a technological novelty to a product sophisticated enough to serve multiple roles within the economy. It is anticipated that the robot would perform in the motor industry, function as a guide, a sale attendant, an administrator, and in the future, a domestic helper and caregiver. Toshiba, a Japanese company, introduced the new version of its humanoid robot named Chira Kanai at an exhibition in Berlin. The robot's form has become more anthropocentric, and its motions are more fluid. Chira Kanai was put behind an information desk from which the robot could attend to visitors with verbal questions. As in the case of the bot preceding this model, Chira Kanai can hear and speak English, Japanese, Chinese, and even sign language. We have made great advances in the appearance of Chira Kanai in a bid to make the machine more acceptable to people, especially older individuals. This is vital because apart from tourism and hospitality, Chira Kanai will also be deployed in the healthcare industry to assist elderly people, which is why he'll need to be more relatable," said one of the company's spokespeople. Together with the TMS Medical Company, Researchers from Japan's Tori University Hospital purchased a revolutionary construction medical simulation robot built using a 3D printer. The robot, who goes by the name of Makoto, is aimed for use with medical students and offers hands-on training unlike any other. To increase the realism of medical training, Makoto has been designed to externally express pain and even has a gag reflex. Not only does the robot have an external lifelike appearance, its internal body structure is also 3D multi-part printed. The internal parts include a tongue, airway, and esophagus. These internal parts were designed with the help of real patients' CT scans. Initially, Makoto's capabilities were set to three essential medical operations, endotracheal intubation, gastrointestinal endoscopy, sputum suctioning. To maximize training, the robot is smart enough to rate each user based on the set performance criteria relative to the functioning exercises done. NVIDIA's new technology. NVIDIA has launched a new approach that enables robots to mimic human activities by harnessing video footage as the primary reference. This technique developed takes place in two stages. First, robots are placed in a simulated environment and guided to follow the motions of trained sport professionals. Then, engineers build realistic mechanical limitations into the system to capture the differences between the computer animation and real movements. Then, 
They are refined by experts to make the movements closer to real life. Considerable accuracy is achieved. This technique lets robots learn exclusively from watching videos, which is unlike other traditional methods that require them to wear sensors. They can now use any recorded footage from sporting events, dancing competitions, or anything else for that matter in order to enhance their performance. This technology is not expected to revolutionize robotics only, but will also have an impact in animation, virtual reality, and any other domains where precise movements are fundamental. Currently, Boston Dynamics has bound themselves to a higher self-restraint limit, which prevents them from revealing too much intel on their system. However, it is known that the company used a similar approach some time ago to enable their robots to dance.